What's up you guys? Thank you for joining us for another video in our how to series. Valerie from Motorverse is here and today I'm going to be talking about the leading e-commerce solution that will help you start selling on WordPress. If you're thinking about monetizing your online project or starting an e-commerce store via WordPress, this video should be right down your alley. You might already guess that I mean WooCommerce, and since its release in 2011, it has become a priority for many businesses due to its top-notch features. WooCommerce became one of the most popular e-commerce platforms for good reason. A lot of people trust and love the WooCommerce platform, and not to be unfounded, I'll simply present the facts and statistics and let you draw your conclusions. So, if you're on the fence to choose the right platform for your site, this video will help you determine the choice. WooCommerce is one of the most popular WordPress plugins that has surpassed 5 million installs. And this is just one stat related to WooCommerce. Stay with us and learn about some more fascinating facts, as well as steps you should take to get your feet wet. Let's begin! WordPress is a CMS used to create websites, blogs, mailing lists, and more. It powers approximately 43 of all websites currently on the internet and 20.1% of WordPress-powered websites use WooCommerce, which is really impressive. And this is fact number two. According to a report by TransBuiltWith.com, top brands like Theme Forest, Hotstar, Forbes, Code Canyon, Elegant Themes, Pinterest, Transmeter, and UNICEF use Woo to power their websites. Actually, the list is very long with over 6 million results. Moreover, most of these websites have high economic value and revenue amounts to thousands of dollars. We must admit, the list of WooCommerce competitors is long. However, let us see how it compares against its top competitors. Evidently, WooCommerce tops the chart with the largest share in the market as compared to other e-commerce platform technologies. So, WooCommerce market share is 38.71% with more than 2,734,293 companies using this software in their tax tax including Amazon.com, Microsoft, and Google. Starting an online store is a great way to set the ball rolling with an online business. You can use WooCommerce to sell both physical and digital products. You can even sell both digital and physical products at the same time. And if you plan to sell services like memberships and online courses with the right plugins and tools, you can easily add this functionality to your WooCommerce store, including restricting access to products, offering special discounts or shipping methods and more. And once you know what you're going to sell on WordPress, the first step is to get a domain name web hosting and an SSL certificate. A WordPress theme controls how your store will look. So the next step is installing a theme. For this, go to Appearance Themes. As you see, there is no shortage of free themes to choose from. WooCommerce themes will help you create elegant and authentic shops and stores. There are thousands of themes available to suit all kinds of websites. To be more precise, WordPress has more than 1,600 WooCommerce themes listed in the WooCommerce theme directory. Additionally, the number of WooCommerce themes on ThemeForest stands at around 1,300. 
Wu Themes by Motorfress offers something more than just stylish, outstanding design. All of our themes are optimized for quick and easy checkout and come with powerful customization options, pricing and assortment settings, inbuilt payment gateways, and more tools to take care of all aspects of your store. And if you're interested, don't forget to check them out on motorpress.com. It's important to note that you can add WooCommerce to an existing website, for example, to sell merch. WooCommerce will work with any theme, but may require some additional styling. Also, if you're planning Woo integration, it's important to have a backup of your site before proceeding. So, after activating the WooCommerce plugin, you'll be taken to the WooCommerce Setup Wizard, where you'll need to configure your store options. After you finish the Store Setup Wizard, you'll be able to add your first product. And when your store is set up, you can customize its style and look. Keep in mind that your store design will depend on your theme, so it's important to choose the right one. The last step is to add extra functionality to your store with WooCommerce extensions. And there are hundreds of free and paid WooCommerce extensions that you can choose from. They add extra features, such as ability to sell your products on Facebook, sync your customers with your MailChimp subscribers, offer extra payment gateways, sell subscriptions, add extra shipping options, and more. And needless to say, your final goal is to drive traffic to the store and, of course, to generate sales. There are many ways to promote your business and increase e-commerce store sales, so this topic deserves a whole different video. And if you're interested in such a video, let us know in the comments below. And the last interesting fact for today, WooCommerce is popular across geographic borders and is used in 100 plus countries and currently supports 67 languages. To wrap things up, if your goal is to create a stable, long-lasting business, the WooCommerce stats we've shown should have convinced you that WooCommerce has all the vital features you need. Its widespread use means it's a tool that lends itself to a wide range of customization options as shown by the number of extensions, templates, and integrations available. Combining WordPress with WooCommerce is a successful strategy that will allow you to take your e-commerce to new horizons with a very low investment. Hope this tutorial helped you, and if you found it useful, I'd greatly appreciate it if you would give it a thumbs up, please subscribe to our channel, and ring the notification bell. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.